Hey, we are out in our back parking lot talking with Jim from NARPRO. A lot of people getting ready right now. Maybe they wanted to avoid the Friday night traffic, so they're going to head up to Flagstaff or Sedona or make a trip to California uh, this morning. What do they need to pack to avoid breaking down in the triple digit heat? Jim is here with the answer, and we know water obviously is a big one. How much water do you want to bring? Well, at, at least a gallon or so for your car, and then plenty for yourself too. Cold water is better, but cool is okay. Hot water doesn't help you out a whole lot, but any liquid you have that you can refresh your body is great. Normally, when you're driving around your car, you need the basics, you know, duct tape and bailing wire and stuff like that. But when it's hot, you definitely have to have water. Uh-huh. You should have, have an umbrella. Not huh. because it's going to rain, because it never does, <laughs> but you <laughs> need to bring your year. own shade. Interesting. Shade makes you a lot cooler in Arizona. It's a little humid this morning, but normally, just get away from the sun. We'll cool everything down. We'll cool it down. What else do we need to pack? Well, I like these new jumper batteries that they have. It's it's a battery pack you can use to jumpstart your car. Oh, I've never seen Or that. to recharge your cell phone. Oh, so it's a so dual purpose. Right, you can plug, plug your cell phone into it. I like that. Heat has a tremendous effect on your tires. And one of the biggest problems is people driving around with a tire that's under pressure. If, if it says 32 pounds, it should be 32 pounds cold. When it's hot, it's more like 35. You need to check your tire pressure cold. So you should do it before you start driving it. Don't drive more than a mile before you check your tire. Okay, so 32 cold, if it's hot, it needs to be at 35. I never right. knew that, because I always look for 32. That's the one thing my dad taught me. 32 is when you want your tires So you drive around in Arizona, you do it when it's 110 degrees outside, you're probably under pressure. Okay, interesting stuff. So we want duct tape, we want uh, wire. I don't have this in my car. Oh, that, you should have that every, that's the basic to fix anything on the planet, duct tape and bailing wire. Okay, good to know. It won't I'm stay gonna pick fixed. Some, some stuff up. Uh, what else do we want to pack? Well, I have gloves, jumper cables, rags are great. The new, uh, rather than using road flares, oh, use a reflectable, um, these will be a triangle that you can set up around your car. Okay. Fire extinguisher is great. This is a good product to have, fix a flat. Huh. It's not a great product to leave in your car. Oh. Any, anything in a can when it's 110 degrees outside could open while you're not in the car. And uh, fix flat spread throughout your car is a heck of a mess. So what do you do with this? Well, um, when you have a flat tire and you don't have a pump, you can put that in it will fill up the tire and it has a sealant in it as well. Okay. It's a good way to get by. It's not a great way to fix a tire, but to get you back on the road, it's a great thing to have. Is this a new product? Or is oh it no, it's been while? around for years. Okay, but now people know about it. Or now I know about it. You're just you teaching know. me, you're teaching me all kinds of things. We really just set up this segment just for me. Uh, is there anything else we need to pack? Flashlight we know, emergency kit right here, just with uh, roadside kit, safety things. Oh, your cell phone. It, it, best way to fix a car anymore is be able to call somebody and get help. That's so bring your cell phone. Okay, you going anywhere this Labor Day? Actually, I'm staying at home. You're staying, staying at with the home. family. Okay, yeah. but if you are going somewhere this Labor Day, make sure uh, you pack all of the essentials so that you can get to your destination safely. We know the heat. Ah, it's not always. It's never good to break down in the heat. But Jim is here, and thanks so much for helping us out this morning. We're gonna take a quick break. Morgan.